It's Monday, April 16th, and am I vlogging out of the car? Yes, yes I am. Why? Well, um, because I thought I might get better lighting and whatnot in here, but we'll see. Maybe I'll do some more vlogs out of the car, that way I have better lighting than I do in my room, but hey, we'll see what happens. Anyway, it's about 10 o'clock or so, and why am I up this early? Well, uh, we scheduled a, uh, an appointment to go to, uh, get a massage, both me and my mom separately, of course, weirdos, anyway, and it's her first time getting, um, a massage from anywhere, anybody, professionally, or whatever, uh, after that, we plan on, uh, going to the mall and going to see if we can go um see our chiropractor so we get that out of the way as well so we don't have to get out of the apartment later on today so we can just be home um and be lazy and whatnot but yeah so and yeah um i don't know if you can tell in the background or not it's like i said april and it's freaking snowing but what else can you expect from weather in kentucky we just uh, got out of the uh, Massage Envy. My mom had our first massage, like I said in previous video. Her first massage ever, and she didn't like it at all. Nope, I don't want to go back. Nope, no Bold she doesn't. shit. Exactly. And now we're at a Speedway, uh, stopped for some delicious Speedway coffee, and we got some cookies and some tornados, because they're delicious. So, I'll see if I add more to this later. Continuation of the Monday vlog. Um, so, after we uh, got uh, uh, some snacks and coffee at Speedway, we went to the mall, found what we were looking for, and going back to the mall tomorrow. I uh, might do some lugging in the wall just because to insert it in here. After that, we went to our uh, chiropractor and uh, got that taken care of so we didn't have to go later in the day, which by now is earlier in the day, but um, so we could just be home and be lazy and whatnot. Um, what else happened? Oh, uh, the cookie that we got at the uh, uh, Speedway gas station, uh, as we were uh, exiting the car in our parking lot here, I dropped the cookie on the ground on the pavement. Well, luckily I'm not too disgusted or whatever. Uh, and I just picked it up and it's almost eaten. So yeah, three second rule. Why the fuck not? So hmm, that's about it. So I'll see if I uh, add more today. So we just uh, came back from the mall, got some stuff taken care of there, and got my necklace fixed so I can finally have a normal looking necklace, not that anybody could see, but anyway, it was hard to um, clip together, put on, whatever the hell, I don't know. So I can wear my uh, little scarab pendant, then I have to get a um, different necklace and a little key loop-de-loop -loop thing that I'm gonna uh, put that this on and wear it on the necklace. So, fingers crossed. Ordered one necklace a while back and hopefully it'll come in the mail soon. But that's it for today. We'll see if I add more later. This is Tuesday. I'm not sure what date it is, but anyway. Um, and nothing really has happened today that's worth vlogging, but um, in my previous vlog, I named some amazing artists who I have uh, on my walls, as you see back there once again. And, um, there he is. Um, but one person who is the first person whose art I had, not on my wall, but in my room, years and years and years ago, is Joey James Hernandez. He is an awesome artist from New York who has done some amazing work for two of my top three favorite bands being Otep and Typo Negative. 
Uh, of course, my favorite piece of his is this one right here. Yes, that is me that he did. How awesome is that, right? And then the other thing of his that I love and always tell people about is this shirt. See if I can uh, show you. It's that it is that shirt right there, uh, type one negative shirt that I got eh, that I got at a type one negative concert in uh, 2008. It was a concert T-shirt, so I love wearing it. I love type one negative. I love his work. Whenever somebody comments, "Hey, it's an awesome shirt," I always. Uh, try to pull his work up on Instagram or Facebook or show him and tell them, hey, check out uh, Joey James Hernandez on Instagram or here, here, here. His artwork is amazing. So uh, once again, sorry, Joey. I uh, forgot to mention you in my previous vlog, but I made sure to do a section this time just about you and your fucking amazing work. Go check out Joey James Hernandez. And that's it for today. It's Saturday, April 21st, and I haven't vlogged much for the past few days. Nothing really eventful has happened. So, I don't know. Just making a vlog about that, I guess. Uh, although, yesterday, I did get um, some new gauges that my mom ordered me through Wish. They are, the, uh, as you can see... Uh, Aquarius symbol. Um, I don't care much for horoscopes or whatever that, you know, astrology or, yeah, whatever it's called. I don't, I don't care for it much or believe in it, but um, um, I like the imagery. That's about it, which is why I wear, why I got that and why I started, yeah years ago, uh, before I got injured. I might have to make a video about that so I don't have to keep explaining to people um, why I got injured and how, but we'll see. Um, started on a water demon uh, uh, tattoo. I was going to go with a dragon or something, but I was like, ah, well, I like demon things and stuff, so I decided to go with the water demon and... I got the tattoo just as I got a car, which was my mom's old car, and now our current car, um, and got an awesome job and everything, and got the tattoo, whatever, and then I just got injured, or I just got injured when I, I like, a little bit after I got the tattoo, and I haven't been able to get it finished, so all I have is this giant awesome looking outline, but can't get it filled out, because I don't have any money, but, you know, I'm not disabled or fucking anything, Ugh. So anyway, anyway, as usual, I go off on a rant. But that's it. I'll see if I add more to this Saturday or or tomorrow or whatnot. If not, that's it for this week, but we'll see. It's Sunday, and uh, Mom's coming from work soon, and she asked if we want to go to the mall, if I want to go to the mall for a little bit. Sure, why not? Not like I have any other plans. And yes... Very good of you to notice that this is another Joey James Hernandez shirt. This time it's Otep. Hell fucking yeah! Um, now I just need to uh, uh, have a uh, bleeding through <laughs> uh, shirt by Joey. And my collection of my favorite three bands will be complete. So, yeah. But, uh, I don't know, maybe I'll add more vlogging about today or as I'm going through the mall or if I find anything at the mall that I might get, which is highly doubtful since the last few times I've been at either St. Matthew's Mall or J Mall, I've found really nothing that I was like, oh my god, this is fucking amazing, I have to get this right now, but who knows, we'll see. It's uh, Sunday night, and the last, I think, maybe, I'll see, addition to this vlog, um, came back from the mall, spent there quite a bit of time, um, found a few things I liked, surprisingly, and they were at Hot Topic, 
surprise. Um, only thing I did get at the mall was this $9 necklace that I plan on uh, putting this as a charm on, but first I need a loop-de-loop or something thing to hook it on there or whatever. Uh, I asked some guys, one of those random booths at the mall, how much it would be, and he was like, oh yeah, we can solder that for about 50 bucks. I'm like, um, no thanks. I'm pretty sure I can find a friend who can solder that, or what I plan on doing is getting one of those loop-de-loop -loop things that goes on a keychain and a small one, put it on there, and just put it on my necklace, because I really don't care, and I just wanted to be on there. My mom bought me that, so. Anyway, uh, what else did I find? Found a, uh, uh, a Hot Topic, I was trying to find a, uh, like, a sleeveless shirt, uh, tank top, there we go, tank top, um, I don't feel like comfortable calling it a wife beater, but anyway, uh, a tank top, uh, from Ravenclaw, but apparently it's only for girls and they were out of it. I did find another Ravenclaw shirt that I was gonna buy. But that's also for girls, and I tried it on, and it was large, and it was way too small, and the opening on the front was obviously for cleavage, and for the latest, my hairy cleavage, it wouldn't have worked. Some people might disagree, but yeah, no. Um, found a button-up shirt that uh, had uh, death, death head moths on it, I guess, or whatever, like the ones that were featured on... Uh, uh, Sons of the Lambs movie. It was an interesting button-up shirt, but I really don't need that many button-up shirts, and it was not something I was like, oh my god! Only thing that I did see that I was like, oh my god, that was pretty cool, was a, um, necklace that had a, uh, satanic pentagram with it, but, uh, kind of like this, but it was the Black Craft Gold logo, and... It said, uh, create your own future on it, but you can, as you open the pendant, there was another hidden pendant inside that says, sinners are winners, and it was about 10 bucks. I almost got it, but one was broken and missing half of the, the create your own future pentagram part, and the other one was flimsy, so I didn't want to get it. So I might still get it over the interwebs, I might not. I don't know. I'll include the link down below uh, so you guys can see what I'm talking about. It's pretty cool, but now that I didn't get it, my first reaction was like, I must have this! And now that I haven't didn't get it on, like, first reaction, I was like, mm, do I really want to get it? Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Um, we got some Chinese food, as just about every other time. Um, ate, and now we're gonna go watch something? I don't know what, but that's it, maybe, or this week? We'll see if I had more, but probably not.